Well, hey everyone, how's it going? It's Metal. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to some more Wes Craven reviews. And yes, I know, it's been two years since my last Wes Craven title that I reviewed, which was Wes Craven's Chiller. So that was about two years ago. Holy crap. But yeah, we're back at the swing of things, and uh, let's get right into it. All right, so today's Wes Craven title is going to be for The Serpent and the Rainbow, starring Bill Pullman. Yeah, so Bill Pullman's character, who is an anthropologist, or however you say it. Yeah, uh, he's an anthropologist that goes to uh, um, Haiti. I think that's the country's name, Haiti. He goes to Haiti uh, um, after hearing about a rumor um, about this drug used by magic in order to turn people into zombies and that's the kind of the gist of it of what i can understand really so let's get into my overall thoughts on it so i have to say that as a wes craven fan i respectfully dislike this movie entirely i did not like this movie at all in the slightest i feel ashamed in saying that i feel i i, I brutally feel terrible saying that as a diehard wes craven fan i didn't like this movie i've seen it recently and uh yeah, The Serpent and the Rainbow is odd and strange and weird. It is not a movie that I can really get into all that much, and it's super confusing. A lot of the plot uh, details really went way over my head. I mean, holy crap, this movie is tough to understand, at least in my perspective. But wow, I just didn't like this movie. I just couldn't really get into it. It's probably just not for me. I don't know. I really don't understand. I don't quite know what Wes Craven was really going for with his vision with this movie because I just don't get it. It is a lot to uh, take in and well, not really in a good way either, but like there's just a lot of things that I need to fully kind of think about and kind of grasp. So um, yeah, I mean, this is probably, probably going to be like one of the most shortest reviews I've ever done for a Wes Craven title. So yeah, that's kind of my thoughts on the serpent and the rain, like in the rainbow, the serpent and the rainbow. There you go. Uh, it's, I'm going to give it a D minus simply because there was a lot of effort put into this movie and I don't really want to disrespect that at all. I love Wes Craven. I love all of his work. Uh, this this one is just not for me. So, what did you guys think of The Serpent and the Rainbow? I would love to hear your thoughts down below in the comment section. I will be sure to read that. I never leave you guys hanging. You guys all know that already. So, until next time, everybody, take it easy, guys, and take care, everyone.